Okay, this is my first step in getting all this good gear off of this table, hooked up and in production. Uh, first thing I'm going to do is get the heart rate monitor set up, hook up the strap, I'll talk about how to put it on, how to use it, take care of it, and then I'll demonstrate just before I get on my wonderful spin bike and do a little workout just to see how it feels and stuff and uh, show you the results. Okay, here it is all set up. It was pretty quick. The uh, if you hold the button down, it goes pretty. It scrolls pretty quickly. The back works really well. Uh, pretty flawless so far. And now a little bit about the uh, chest strap. This is a fabric. Most of them are plastic. This is fabric. This these are where the electrodes are. They pick up your heart rate. You have to get those wet. And uh, the nice thing about this is this clicks in. And you click it out when you're done and the reason is for that is because because it is fabric which is the reason I think it does well in the water it also when it stays wet it keeps uh, this going so it wears down the battery so it's a chance to uh, not wear down the battery and clean it up pretty well so now I'm going to just show you uh, quick uh, putting it on sinking it uh, pairing it up and then I'll get going and then I'll show you what it looks like when we're done Okay, I'm at the spin bike, got my spinning shoes on, and I'm going to do the justice a little bit. All it takes to adjust is just hold it like that, readjusting this little clip. And the way this works in the back is this clip right here just sits right down there. That's all there is to it. So I'm going to take, take it like this, bring it around, center it right below my chest and then I'm going to pair it up okay so I have the heart rate monitor and the chest strap hooked up so now all I have to do is go to there it's looking for the chest strap it has found it and to start my workout all I now have to do now is how simple it is There's my heart rate, there's time, everything else. You can do laps with it. So, uh, pretty cool stuff. <coughs> so now I'm gonna do a nice, easy spin. Uh, always important to warm up first when you're doing anything. Right there. Get going. The watch is uh, recording my heart rate, and I'll report back in an hour and show you the, what the difference is. Alright, here I am on the bike. Nice thing about the heart rate monitor is the spin bike monitor picked it right up. You can see the uh, got distance and everything else. But here is the heart rate monitor. And the nice thing about it is it has your actual heart rate, your average, total time working out, and uh, the time of day it is. And then if you hit this, it tells you what zone you're in. I'm not talking about zones and periodization training. Uh, how long you've been in that zone, how many calories, and total time on this one right here. So let me see if I can get a... There it goes. So there's everything, and this is just plugging right along, and they're pretty close. All right, we're at the end of the workout, an hour and one minute so far, but the, uh, actually an hour, but the, uh, you can see an hour, it's 11.26 in the afternoon. My average heart rate is 140, which is where I wanted it to be, staying aerobic. 138 is my current. If I do this, you'll see right now I'm in level three. That's the one up here. Uh, 29 minutes in that level, which is aerobic, and uh, 830 calories, and it gives you the time again. Yeah, it's kind of high, but when I have my ankle sprain, I gained some weight, so partially loosen the weight as I do this process. All right, I unhooked it. I uh, it wasn't happy. I was hot with the heart rate. Kept looking for it again. You can see a quick summary here: 845 calories. Uh, 
Average heart rate of 140, which is great for me, keeping at my level 3, which is aerobic. Uh, quick uh, reminder, what I'm going to do right now is unhook this. I'll clean this up and be ready to go next time. So look forward to next time. And one other note is I had to get up while I was doing my spinning and uh, get a uh, water bottle because I forgot to get water. So make sure you have water, make sure you do it moderately, and have fun.